This video is not financial advice. I am not a financial planner. I'm an entertainer. The one and only ape father in the house, baby, up all night. Wow! You know, I was doing some research, you know, also on progenity. And, uh, you know, very shocking, you know, because I, I, I originally thought a lot of the shorts have been covered. And, uh, no, nah, you know, they're doing tremendous, tremendous uh, dark pool activity. It's actually up to, if you consider... It's something like around 12% short interest, but if you consider the dark pools with Mr. Shitadel himself, Ken Griffin, it's around 50% short interest, okay, in progenity in Prague. So guess what? The short the short squeeze could still happen with Prague, okay? So, I mean, listen, like I said, I think it's a phenomenal long-term play based on its fundamentals. You know, they're getting patents like crazy. They're going to disrupt the $100 billion industry. But you know what? With the dark pool interest, it's around 50% short. So guess what, guys and girls? There could be a short squeeze. I mean, you know, in Art Ortex, the analysts were saying that they're putting a price target on Prague back at six. So you know what? We could might, might see a gamma squeeze. We got to get it above three. If we could hold it above three, I think uh, it's very possible to get back to the highs. You know, at least six bucks. So right now is a good time to get in. I mean, like, it's, what is it, a... Uh, Last I checked, it was 287, okay? So, but I do consider this a great long-term play. Long-term, I see this in the three digits one day because when they announce that partner baby, when they get a buyout from a huge pharmaceutical giant like a Pfizer, like a Merck, it's going to be tremendous. I do see Prague hitting the three digits. But for now, we might see a gamma squeeze. Why not, right? Sounds good to the eight father. Just wanted to update my eight family.